Hi, right, good morning, good morning, good afternoon. That's good evening. Depending on your time zone, we're connecting with live this beautiful Monday morning right in Benin City. Yes, first, I want to thank God Almighty for this privilege and then the grace to uh, to see today. And more importantly, how that uh, whatever we uh, actually set out to achieve, we achieve it considering several things such as um, standardization such as budgeting and especially such as timing uh, for anyone who follow me very well you will know that um, these um, veranda currently has taken a very new a very new shape and you can see the artwork design done on this side so uh, what we actually did on this side uh, was to um, install the artwork on this side install the artwork on this side and at the same time um, the interior um, dressing for the windows was not achieved and then we did that but carefully just follow me as i take you through um, the job that was done on this side so you can see uh, the artwork on this pillar so this is a direct a direct artwork casting it's a direct artwork casting why this is the middle pillar and then you have this other end so follow me as i take you through the floor let's go around the house so this is the first window at the veranda and then at this end we we did a belt we did a belt a chain belt you can also see this point as well you can also see this point as well so we did a chain belt that went around the house a chain belt that went around the house so let's go carefully let's go carefully all right so you can see this is still the chain belt there's a chain belt it went around the house yeah so the back here has no window that's the design of the house the back here but if i was to if i was to have been the one that built this house i think I, I would have probably installed a window right here but the back has no window so you can see this point as well completed this point as well completed Completed. So I'm going to take you indoor so you can see. Also completed. Yeah. And this is um, the veranda that leads to the kitchen. This is the veranda that leads to the kitchen. And then we are back at the front again. We are back at the front again. So you can see how. Um, the artwork actually brought out the beauty of this project. The artwork actually brought out the beauty of this project. So let's go in. So let me take you. Yeah. So this is um, the bar spot. This is the bar spot. That's the bar spot. And then also the dining spot. This is the dining spot. And guess what? We have four and a half bags left. We have four and, a, uh, four and a half bags of cement left. So what actually happened? We actually um, brought in um, 18 bags of cement. Actually brought in 18 bags of cement. And we have four and a half bags of cement left. So this is so what was actually done earlier on. They just installed the window. Before they brought the window, they've installed the burglary you understand they installed the burglary because before they brought in the window so when they brought in the window they were supposed to remove the burglary you get the point and install um the, the window and the frame properly but they didn't do that but we came in and um, our job was to do the artwork but we thought it wise that oh we cannot leave the site like this we have to do a perfect job and have, because of that we had to renegotiate on the project and then you can see has been completed Let's check the dining as well. 
has been dressed. So they didn't even plaster here. You understand? They didn't plaster here. So the guys I brought in that did that, yeah, the guys I brought in that did that. All right, so let's move. Let's move. So this is another room, also completed as well. Let's move in. It's a three bedroom. Yes, it's a three bedroom. All right. This one as well, also completed. And then this other room. So what the guys actually did, they pulled out the burglary, pulled out the burglary, do a proper dressing, and then they hang the burglary back. And so for us, we were glad, we were excited that this project has got into this phase and we are closing this project at this very point in time to hand over this project back to the client. Yeah, so guess what? The client is not around. Neither is any member of his family around. And we are working and we are ensuring accountability and transparency. And you can see this is four and a half bags of cement. Naturally, we budgeted 20 bags of cement for this job, but this is what we do. What we do is that we ensure that we keep room or we give room, you understand, so that we do not stress our client. You get the point? We do not stress our client. But at the end of the day, when we have materials left on the site, that shouldn't be for me. You get the point? That should be for the client. So we are reporting these bags of cement back to the client. Don't forget that we brought in 18 bags of cement and now we have four and a half bags left. Do your calculation. How many bags of cement did we actually use? Thank you so very much and God bless you.